Hi, welcome again to yet another lesson. We are going to talk about the creation of God. First and foremost, let us look at the things that some some of the things that God created. Sorry. All right. So we can see that God created human beings. He created a man and a woman. So the picture below, you can see the man and the woman who were created by God. God also created different kinds of animals. So in the picture below, you see different kinds of animals. You see flying animals, swimming animals, animals on land. They, they are all the creation of God. God also created different kinds of plants. Tall plant, short plant, huge plant, small plant, crawling plant, creeping plants, God created them all. He also created water bodies. He created rivers, seas, lakes, streams, lagoons. They were all created by God. He also created different, different types of landforms. Mountains, hills, valleys, flatlands. They were all the some of the land that created by God. God also created the sky and the things in the sky. So the sky and things in it include the sun, the stars, and the moon. They were all the creation. So someone will say, will ask, who is God? Who is God? And God is the originator of all things. He created the world and all the things in it. God lives in the heavens. He is a spirit. We cannot see him, but he sees us. He has some names that are that we use to call him, and these names are called his attributes. Okay, so this attribute makes him special. Some of the attributes is God is omnipotent, which means he is all powerful. Another one is God is omniscient, meaning God is God knows everything. The last one is God is omnipresent, which means God is yeah. everywhere. I hope you have enjoyed God the Creator and you have learned a few things here. All right, stay tuned with us. We'll come back another time with another lesson. Bye.